Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Another way of adding paragraph indentation is to use the four indentation markers that are provided on the horizontal ruler. So first you have to make sure your ruler is displayed. If it's not, you can choose to display it by making sure that you select view and ruler to turn it on. Now these markers are the left indent, which is the one that's the small square on the bottom, the first line indent, which is the one that points downward, looks kind of like a home plate, hanging indent, which is the one that points upward looking like a home plate, and the one that's far at the right end looks like hanging indent, but is actually the entire right indent. And so you can drag the indent markers in to indent the paragraph as needed. Either a first line hanging, which is used for bibliographies, or the left and right. Note that you could also set different indentations for different paragraphs. Just make sure you've selected or clicked into the paragraph on which you'd like to set the formatting of the paragraph and its indentation before making changes to the indentation marks located in the ruler. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.